only be eating microwave food. Calm down. Me. Calm down. How How could dare you? I'm a bit unsure about this one. This could go completely wrong. I have got a special surprise for you later. Oh, this is harder than I thought it would be. How can you expect me to eat this? Happening free gang, we are coming to you live, but not live from our home in London. It's grey, it's rainy, it's a perfect day to stay indoors, to be honest. Let us know where you guys are coming live, but not live from. Is it rainy and cloudy and you want to stay indoors? Let us know in the comments below. I am very grateful for the rain right now, though, because the trees and everything needed a good water. I know everything's just come back green and fresh, hasn't it? Yeah. Today, guys, we have indoors a very fun challenge. It's a food challenge. We like eating food. You like eating food? Yeah, like food challenges food. are my favorite challenges. But today, this is one that we have never done before, as for 24 hours the whole day, we are gonna only be eating microwave food. I'll be honest. I'm a bit unsure about this one. We haven't used a microwave or eaten food from a microwave in a very, very long time. So it is good that we have got a really high quality microwave to help us with this challenge. So this is the high quality microwave oven we were talking about by Toshiba. They have kindly sponsored this video. As you can see, it's really nice looking, made with black stainless steel, 800 watts of power, 23 litre capacity, and this is going to power us through this challenge today. What I really like about this is that it's clear to them that details matter as they really pay attention to the craftsmanship, the design, the quality, and any other details to make this an efficient microwave oven. It's got 11, yes, that's right, I said 11 levels of power, which is going to give you a broad range of heating modes so you can do all kinds of things for all different types of food. You have of course got your basic functions that you get with a microwave oven, but what I like about this is you've got some popular preset ones, which has the heat and time already preset according to the button. So you can have ones for a potato, you press that, it will select the time and the heat and just do it automatically. Same for frozen veg, pizza, dinner plates, beverages. What's quite cool too is you can actually program your own preset times for a specific meal. So if there's something you have a lot, you can set up the time, the power, everything and then at the touch of a button you can just set it off each time it has a five blade fan so the actual sound of it is quite low what's really good as well for safety it's got a child lock function which basically prevents young kids pressing the buttons and activating it in any way you know what it's like for very young children toddlers they'll see the buttons they want to press them it makes the sounds they probably find it enjoyable but with a touch of a button you can put the child lock on it completely disables all buttons stops the little ones from playing with it like it's a toy I will put a link in the description so you can find out all about this product guys, so go and check it out. But I'm really looking forward to all of the stuff we're going to make in this. I can't believe that we're going to be making all of our meals in this. Katie and Jojo went and picked out lots of things yesterday, and so we're going to show you the sorts of foods that we've got to eat today. So look all this lovely food that Jojo and I got last night. So we've got some chilli, some jacket potatoes, noodles, got some garlic bread baguettes, lots of different stuff, some porridge oats, lots of different stuff we can cook in the microwave. Question is though, first meal, breakfast. It's breakfast time, I'm hungry, what are we eating? So, Jojo and I found these, which are some kind of oats, which you Instant can do. Instant porridge oats, basically. And you can do them, and apparently it only takes two minutes in I the like that, I like that. That's one thing I'm looking forward to in this challenge, quick food. So we got those, but also we found these. We had to check everything to see if it said on it, you can do it in the microwave. We were debating this one because it, it yeah. didn't say that you could do it in the microwave, Did but it? we wanted to test out, could we do it in the microwave? Because we really what wanted to buy these, but, but we're gonna test that yeah, out. Yeah, they're bean filled hash browns. I know, I've never seen anything like this. We actually went to a few different places because we were trying to just find as many different things you could do in a microwave as possible. We found cord on the cob that you can do it in the microwave. 
Yeah, like Jojo said, we got these ready meals, which is basically a meal completely done already for you. And apparently it takes 16 minutes in the microwave, so we can have a lot of extra time today, I think, to do things we want to do, so, rather than cooking. So first up then we're saying porridge oats and bean stuffed hash browns. The porridge can be fast, then. Yeah, we'll have the porridge first. These can be the part one to the breakfast, and these can be the second part. One thing I'm really curious about is these, which are microwave chips. And I really love chips, so we were really happy to find these, weren't we? Mm. Do you see a song in the world called Mike Rowave? <laughs> so his first name's Mike. Yeah. And his second name's Rowave. Yeah. Ah. Comment below if that's your name, Free Gang. <laughs> also, you two, I have got a special surprise for you later. What? Ooh. What? You're gonna love it. It's something that you can only do in a microwave. I'm telling you now that there's gonna be a surprise later. Okay, so what's the surprise? You'll find out later. <sighs> Jojo also wanted to share something as well. You've given the microwave a name, haven't yeah, you? It's Mike. Mike. Very original, Jojo. How long did that take you to think up? Two seconds. Two seconds, as quick as a microwave. I love it. You're a genius. You're a genius. Let's get breakfast on. Two minutes. That is a very small amount. I mean, that might be okay for me, but not you and Jojo. So it's saying that you have to fill this up with milk or water. I'm going to use water. And it measures that amount. Yeah, and then you pour it in. This is the easiest food prep ever. So, mummy, here's an actual nice tip about this as well. It's got this express cook section. The numbers one to six are automatically programmed to cook for that long at maximum power. So you can just press two for two minutes, and that's it. Wow, that was easy. Now you've got all that time to do all the things you want to do. What do you want to do? Go and have a dance, come on. Oh, thank you, mummy. Mm. Porridge! It's like, it's like the three bears. How quick was that as well? Yeah. We found actually with the first bowl that two minutes was too much. The microwave's so powerful, we only needed to do it for one and a half, didn't we? Yeah, and we found out we needed to cover it as well. Yes. So we covered them with a plastic plate. Okay, so where's you, your guys? Porridge and breakfast. All right, Goldilocks. You want to try everybody's, do you? My hair's not gold. This one's too hot. Don't start. We are not actually. Doing that. Yeah, mine looks a bit lumpy. Yours actually looks like baby bears. As long as I'm still daddy bear, that's all that matters. Is it good? Mm -hmm. mm. Gotta admit, you love how quick it is making mm. breakfast. You had all that time to dance. You did a lovely dance for a game. How is it, Daddy Bear? Daddy Bear. You're not gonna call me Daddy Bear every meal, just this one, right? Just this one. It's good. Looking forward to having those hash beans. Is that what you should call them? Hash beans? No. Hash browns. <laughs> no, you're feeling me. This is what happens when we get extra time. Good stuff. Good stuff. Good stuff. Are, we, are, we, are we having this second part? <laughs> Right. Anyway, microwave, lovely meal. Okay, here we go. They're beautiful. Emily came out and saw these and was very excited. So beans filled hash browns. Never seen anything like this, but anyway. Oh my goodness! This is the huge. They're huge. I didn't think they'd be that chungus. They're chungus. I think we're not gonna probably eat them. Put all of them in there. No, put all of them put in there. Put all of them in there. Okay, okay. Mummy. Damn. How could dare you? So, how long are we thinking for these, mummy? What's your gauge? Um, two minutes. Two minutes? I don't know! What, are we going to check them after two minutes and then just see if they cook through? This thing's pretty powerful, so two minutes might be enough. Jojo, okay. do the honours, press number two. Ooh, I'm looking forward to trying these. They smell really nice, actually. So, have they got a potato in there as well as beans? And beans, yeah, I guess. Yeah, that's it. Good microwave. Right, there's a second part to your breakfast. Ooh, thank you so much. I want to test, though, if it does actually have beans in it. You're, well, you're the hash brown tester. If it doesn't have beans, then we've been missold this product. We've right? been missold. Oh. <laughs> you're actually cutting it open and having a proper look inside. Yeah, there's beans in there. What are we saying, Jojo? Hash beans. Can you get a bit of the beanage? A bit of beanage. It's good 9.5 out of 10 for me. Oh, 9.5. Okay, what am I going to say then? They're pretty good. 
Yeah. I mean, we got away with doing it in the, in the microwave. Super quick as well. Mm, Good yeah. stuff. I'm looking, I'm really looking forward to some of the meals we got coming today now, especially how quick they are. <laughs> Lunch! That's right, guys. Next meal. We've got some bits together ready to go in the microwave. What have we got, mummy? This would not be a good microwave video without instant noodles. We actually got these from that the 90% discount store Rogers. If you haven't seen that video, check it out. We got some amazing bargains at that place. Um, but yeah, so we thought we'd do include these because you know most people use their microwaves for instant noodles, don't they? Also, we've got some microwave veg, which you keep it in a bag and steam it in the bag somehow in the microwave. And microchips. So I'm not sure about these things, I'm really not sure, but we'll see how they come out. You just open the box and put the box in the microwave, I'm pretty sure. It says do not stack them though. Okay, yeah. I won't stack them in the microwave then. Well, it means we could do more them all together though. I'm looking forward to this. Noodles, chips and veg. We're living the good life here, aren't we? We're living the dream. Although we're not in the van. This is the easiest food prep that I've ever had to do. So I literally pour the water on and put it in the microwave. That is it. the noodles and veg they were easy and now we've got to do the chips you just have to open the top and fold it under and put them in like that you're gonna get all three in there i think I'll, yeah i'll just do them all at the same time hang on how long is it I'm check the box again check the box oh what i've got to look underneath oh this is harder than i thought it would be oh. babe forget it this is too much effort there's a number on the side let's one. call them up <laughs> i think it's like one minute but i'll go through. i can't wait a minute I'm hungry now! Well, I've got to do three minutes because there's three of them, isn't there? Is that how this works? It says shake them. Take them out and shake them. <laughs> They've got stuck! Right. Abort. We're doing one at a time instead. Maybe okay. we should just give up, babe. Ooh, how are we looking, mummy? This is Jojo's. Are you putting the chips on in the box? Should I put the box on there like that? That's cute, isn't it? Put it on there. Those chips look nice. Not many in those boxes, but... You don't get a lot, no. Oh, well, you definitely don't get much now if you're taking them. They're good. <laughs> I'm not sure about them. Anyway, can you just confirm for the free game what these are? Chips. He just loves it when I say chips for some reason. I don't know why. Can you give this to Jojo because he wants to eat in his bedroom? Yeah. I can make out then that I've been slaving over a hot microwave oven. Jojo, Ooh. here is your lunch. Thank you. Look how I've got my chips in a little box. Yeah, do you like them in the box? Yeah, it's very nice. You're tasting one of the chips. Okay, what do you reckon? They're actually really good. Yeah? yeah. <laughs> Mummy wasn't sure. They're actually really good. There was one more in there, but Mummy took it. That's the face you get, Mummy. What are you saying, Mummy? Eating noodles like that? <laughs> Why? Is this specific to microwave noodles, how they have to be eaten? I'm sorry about this free game, you have to see this display. What? Glad we got some veg in there, because I didn't know how much veg would feature in this challenge. Yeah, it's good. Stop eating it like that, what is wrong with you? Yeah, I'm not sure about these chips. Can we put vinegar on them? Yeah, salt and vinegar. Wait a minute, does the salt and vinegar need to be microwaved? No. Vinegar it is then. How is it, Bob? Yeah, it's all looking good. I'm gonna, I'll, I'll... Have some noodles. Okay, yeah, it is tempting. I think I'm going to be the more mature person and not eat them like that. Just do it. Do it. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fine. What do you think of the chips? Have you had one of the chips yet? Have one no, of the chips. what's wrong with me? This is the real test, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Mm. You're all right. Are they? Okay. They're not as good. Yeah, but they're all right. I'm, I'm bearing in mind they're microwave chips. The amount, though, isn't all right. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what are you doing? Play with my Lego figures. Do you want to do some guitar? Yeah. I'm just doing a quick lesson with Jojo for his guitar and I wanted to tell you guys about the song that Jojo's been writing. You took it to your guitar teacher and they started jamming together with this song and it's so good. I'm going to put a clip of, the, of it in now.
really coming along, aren't you? Yeah. That's your own thing, isn't it? Yeah. Be cool just to put some lyrics to it, wouldn't it, as well? Yeah. Yeah, because with a lot of JoJo songs, you come up with the music first and then you put the lyrics after. So for a game, I'm going to play a little rift and what you've got to do is write down in the comments what uh, song you think I'm playing. Oh, very good. Write down in the comments what song you think that is. It's an intro of a song, isn't it? Yeah. Nice. Okay guys, it's time for dinner. So I found these. We have vegetable chilli and vegetable biryani. And it seems pretty easy. You just take it out the cardboard, peel back the film lid and put them in for 16 minutes. So nice and easy and everything's in there it's already made i think two will be enough because these are pretty big meals so i think two will be enough for all of us also with this i'm going to make some garlic bread and i'm going to cut some little squares of cheese and put them in between each slice and so the cheese melts with the garlic bread and put it in the microwave i don't know it doesn't say anything about being able to do that on the pack but i'm going to try it anyway see if it works this is looking interesting, mummy. What's going on now? Well, I've done these. These are the meals. And I just wanted to do some garlic bread with them. But I'm seeing if I can make it interesting and put pieces of cheese in between each one. And then it'll, then hopefully it'll melt in the microwave. That's very interesting. Mm. This is turning out to be a quite a successful day. Is this a surprise? No, this isn't the surprise. Ah, oh, so it's something else. Yeah. You're gonna tell me? No, well, you'll find out. Is it wait and see pie? That's what uh, my mum used to say when we said, Mum, what's for dinner? She always said, wait and see pie. Right, is that where you got it from? Because you used yeah. to say it to Sam and Jamie, and they used to think it was brilliant. Wait I also liked it when they go, no, it's not fair. What would you say? No, it's a circus. It's great being parents. I am a silly mum, though. You I are. am totally silly. Silly wife as well. I think, I think my kids like me for it, though. Okay, this could be a genius move, mummy, or it could be an absolute disaster. I don't know how this is going to turn out. Emily said, can you do bread in a microwave? I was like, you can now. <laughs> I don't know. I could be embarking on something amazing here. Let's see, how long do you think? A minute? Yeah. Okay, let's go for a minute. Mummy, you might actually be a genius. It is. It's all melted. Let me try some. What? I've got to test it. I've got to test it. Oh, it's always you, eh? Well, I made it. I'm testing it, okay? So the cheese is melty, melty. Also, the bread. What's that going to be like? Normally, this would be crispier, wouldn't it, garlic bread? Mm. Is it really squishy? Mmm. Is that what that hand was? Yeah. Squishy. Good? Mm. I think I've discovered something here. Cheesy garlic microwave bread. To be honest, Cheesy garlic bread is a thing already. Just because you did it in a microwave. Yeah, but it's soft it and doesn't moist mean you... and, and yummy and squidgy. Well, it's nice. So are we about ready to serve up our dinner then? Yep. Yeah, and can. then we'll get our surprise after. Oh yeah, you can have your surprise after. Do you want um, the chilli or the, the biryani or the chilli? Can I have a bit of both? I think I'm going to give Jojo the biryani. Why is that? Because the chilli's really spicy. I think it would just be a little bit too spicy for him. I mean, he likes spicy stuff, but he doesn't like too spicy. It's that ruins bit, it. Yeah, it's a bit too spicy, so you can have the chilli. Okay. So, our microwave dinners. What are you thinking, Mummy? I'll be honest, I was looking at the chilli there, and it, it, it didn't look too appealing. This is really nice. I'd like The biryani is? Yeah, it's really nice. Try it. I guess it's good. It's cauliflower rice as well. Try the bread. You'll see what I mean. You're gonna. Wow, that is well squidgy. I know. That's weird. Cooked bread and it's softer than how it was originally. Can I dip the bread in the chili? Is that okay? Try it on its own first. <laughs> how serious are you? Mm. See what I mean? It's nice. I think I've discovered something. So you just said that you think you know what the surprise is. Can you tell me? I think Mummy's gonna make an apple strudel in the microwave. Really, Mummy? Is that true? No, it's not an apple strudel. It is some kind of dessert though. I think you can help me. Really? Yeah, I'll go in the kitchen. I'll tell you what the surprise is. Cause I think you'll really enjoy making these. Okay, well go in there and make it then. Let's hurry up. I can't wait any longer. I've been waiting all day. Okay 
Jojo, come in. Yes. What I have discovered, I did some research and I discovered that you can make a cake in the microwave, in a mug, in two minutes. Really? Yeah, a whole cake. No. No, it's true. And I'm gonna show you how that's, to do it. That's just crazy. I've never done it before. This is the first time I'm ever gonna do this. Mm -hmm. So this could go completely wrong, but hopefully it'll go right. We'll see, yeah? We've got the flour. We've got the two mugs here. Right, so we've got one for you, one for daddy. So it's two tablespoons of flour. We're gonna make a chocolate cake. So we're gonna do two tablespoons of the cacao powder or cocoa powder. Two tablespoons of sugar. We're gonna use coconut sugar. So we need a quarter teaspoon baking powder. Next is a pinch of salt. Oh, oh, okay, stir it round, Jojo. Next is two tablespoons of plant-based milk. One tablespoon of oil for each one. That's it, one for that one. What's this little lumpy, dude? Little bubble. <laughs> little bubble. A quarter teaspoon of vanilla extract. Okay, so we've got all the ingredients in the mugs. I feel like this mug might be a bit big for what we're doing. It's a cup. It's a mug. No, it isn't a mug. I thought with a mug you would have a saucer. Guys, what's the difference between a cup and a mug, please? Because we're... Tell us. We're not sure about this. Shall I think we should use these ones. We we'll use these, yeah? yeah? I'm just gonna pour the ingredients into that one. Let's put it into the smaller cup. This is definitely a cup, because this one has a saucer that goes with it. This one doesn't. Right, so what we're gonna do now, we're gonna get some pieces of chocolate and put them in. Splodge. And then they should melt in the microwave, okay? So hopefully these will rise in the microwave. Yeah. Fingers crossed. Jojo, it's really risen. Oh, wow. Chocolate kind of sunk in there. The chocolate's all melted. Look, see, see how much it's risen. That's the first one. Cheers. Right, let's put that one in then. Check these out, guys. Look at that. Right, should we take them in? Yeah. What is it? It's a mug cake. A, a what? Cup, a cupcake. It's a mug cake. A cake? In a, in a mug. Well, it's, no. in a, it's in a cup. What, from the microwave? Yeah. yeah. Taste it. I haven't tried it yet. I don't know if I... Wait a minute. You've made a cake in the microwave. Took two minutes. Uh-oh. I don't know why. So it's okay. It's okay. I'm sorry, that didn't seem convincing. Got some sort of aftertaste to it. It's think. microwave cake. How can you expect me to eat this? I don't it's know. Like cake, but not cake. Try it. Brilliant. <laughs> Just keep rising. Oh no, is it bad? I don't know, it's just very bland and... I know. Should we use more sugar in there? It, it, yeah, was there any sugar in there? Oh, oh, what? Hold the free gang. Free gang, she better make up for this. I'm not sure what you can do. I, I can do, I can sort it out. I'm gonna put some maple some syrup. some syrup on there, eh? Maple syrup. Maple syrup takes care of everything, Johnson. <laughs> any you... problems in life can be solved with maple syrup. Do you think there's someone in the world called maple syrup? Maple syrup. Mid middle name Paul, first name's May, last name syrup. Yeah. Comment below if that's you. <laughs> right, try that. I'll, I'll be honest, I wasn't being ungrateful. I am very grateful for you making this in the first yeah. place. I know you are. It's just cake in a microwave, really. Calm can down. I the saucer, the saucer. The... Oh no, I can't. It's hot. The pl the cup's pretty hot, so. Okay. okay, now we're talking. Told ya. Got some sweetness to it. Nice. Thank you. Well done. You, Jojo, you the thumbs up from you as well now. So if we make it again, I think maybe just add some more sweetness to it. I've never been much of a sweet you, you, person. You were going to say something then. What were you going to say? You're sweet enough. No, you, I wasn't going to say that, but yes, I am. Do you want some? Yeah, let me try some. <laughs> it's okay. That's pretty impressive though that you can make a cake in a microwave. I mean, it's, it is what it is, right? It's got cake texture. Look, it's cake. You don't get more. Nom, much, nom, 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 nom. You don't get more, much more cake than that. Didn't expect that to be a surprise. That was an interesting challenge eating microwave yeah. food all day. What was your favourite meals? The baked bean filled hash browns. 
Mummy? I think that was my favourite as well, Jojo. That was definitely different. I hope you guys have enjoyed watching this. Leave your comments below. We love always hearing from you. And we will see you all in the next video. Just remember, guys, you guys always stay free. And just keep rising.